What's going on everybody and today I come to you very excited like the excitement levels are so real right now because finally I am playing Dark Souls 2. I've had to wait an extra month to get the game on PC. An extra month of having to dodge spoilers. An extra month of having to suppress the urge to fail miserably because <laughs> that's what's gonna happen but uh yeah Dark Souls 2 is here I, I couldn't be more excited I will say this though before I play the game if you haven't played this yet and you're planning to there's gonna be a lot of spoil this is a full playthrough there's gonna be spoilers up the ass so you might want to go away now if you have already played the game or you don't really care then feel free to stick around but yeah, without not gonna waste any more time playing the fucking game. Here we go. God, I'm so ready for this. Perhaps you've seen it. Maybe in a dream. A murky, forgotten land. Place where souls may mend your ailing mind. You will lose everything once branded the symbol of the curse, an augur of darkness. Your past, your future, your very light. None will have meaning and you won't even care. By then, you'll be something other than human. A thing that feeds on souls, a hollow. Long ago, in a walled-off land far to the north, a great king built a great kingdom. I believe they called it Drang Lake. Perhaps you're familiar. No, how could you be? But one day, you will stand before its decrepit gate without really knowing why. flame. Your wings will burn in anguish. Time after time. For that is your fate. 
the fate of the cursed. Wow, that cutscene was amazing. Things betwixt. Oh, that <laughs> betwixt. What a cool word. Oh, so we got ghosts, we got phantoms already, and no character creation. Weirdly. I don't know what's going on with that. So, what have we got here in Things Betwixt? My controls are. Well, that's how I jump. So, the controls seem to be. The same as um, Dark Souls 1. Just fine by me. Oh, that's a ledge. Don't want to fall off the fucking ledge. There's nothing here. Well, there's a path there. Let's just. Okay, I'm pretty satisfied that this is the only path. Hello? Oh. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to I'm going to punch you. Maybe not. There's a lot. There, there fuck. Let's go in here. <laughs> There's more than one. They're not following me. Okay, maybe they maybe they're not aggressive. I don't know. I I I don't even know. So can I like jump up there? No. Like, I know the house is right there. I'm just checking shit out. Give me a break. I'm extremely excited. <laughs> what seems to be the ruckus? Oh, my. Your face. The face of the curse. It's an undead. An undead has come to play. <laughs> they all end up here. All the ones like you. You spoke to that kind old dear, didn't you? <laughs> You're finished. You'll go hollow. Yes, you'll become one of them. Hollows prey upon men, feast upon their souls. This is the fate of the cursed. <laughs> what is your name? Uh, let's just go with, uh... Let's just go with that. Yeah, accept it. Yes. <laughs> At least you know your own name. Here's your reward for sharing. It's a human effigy. Take a closer look. Think it's supposed to be. Think back deep into your past. Yes, it's an effigy of you. All right, so here's character creation. Okay, so class. What do we got? Warrior. 
Battle Scarred Warrior, High Strength, Dexterity, Skilled with Weapons. Traveling Knight, High HP and Adaptability, Tough to Take Down. Finely Skilled Swordsman, Fights Gracefully with Strong Weapons in Both Hands. A Merciless Outlaw, High Dexterity, Skilled with Bow, Fights Well at Various Ranges. A Cleric on a Pilgrimage, High Faith in Miracles, Guide the Way. Knowledgeable Sorcerer, Cast Sorceries with High Intelligence and Attunement. Well, Travel Explorer, not terribly powerful, but has many items. And the Deprived, Unclothed Origin Unknown, has nothing to fight with except life-affirming flesh. So there's not as many classes to choose from as there is in Dark Souls 1. No Pyromancer, no... The Bandit's different. It's High Dexterity class rather than High Strength class. Swordsman, that looks pretty much like the Wanderer to me. Anyways, I think it's pretty safe to say that my first character, I'm going to screw up the build, so it doesn't really matter what I pick. So I'm just going to go with Warrior. That seems like the most straightforward and probably the most suiting to my particular playstyle. So what is my gift? Nothing. Life Ring. This Ring of Old slightly increases HP. A familiar looking effigy returns the hollow to life. Various items used to cure poison and restore HP essential for anyone traveling. God, what did she say it was called? Drang, Drang Lake? Let's go with that. Homeward Bone. Uh, seed of a Tree of Giants. Bonfire Skedig. Toss into a bonfire to raise the strength of nearby foes. Only for those who seek a greater challenge. Are you kidding me? I'm pretty sure the game's going to be hard enough. Petrified something. As people petrified... I think we'll just go with the life ring. Okay. Body. Uh, I am a male. Uh, build... Let's go with that one. Physique. Let's be really muscly. Let's be ripped. Face. What do we got? Ah, oh, Homeland. So that one. Hair. Uh. Let's just go with that. Hair color. I apologize if watching the character creation isn't that interesting, but it's got to be done. It's got to be done. Let's just go with those. Eye color. My eyes are blue. So we'll go with blue eyes. Go with that one. Beard. You, you can't be a warrior and not have a beard. So we're going to go for this one. You have to have a battle beard. No, wrong color. There you go. Tattoo. I can have a face tattoo. Is there any cool ones? No, I don't really like any of those. Okay, advanced settings. Oh, Jesus. You know, I think it's pretty safe to, to leave all these. Because that's a lot of shit. And, you know, if I was just playing, I would mess around with all those settings. But, for the purposes of recording, I'll just skip those. Is this your true self? I, I guess so. All people come here for the same reason. To break the curse. You're no different, I should think. Hmm. Doesn't stand a chance. Well, you never know. <laughs> <laughs> Over and over again. 
<laughs> She's probably right. <laughs> Black Flamestone Dagger, Black Flamestone Parmer, Yellow Quartz Longsword, Yellow Quartz Shield, Bound Hand Axe. I got a lot of shit. Okay. Let's close that. Trying to guess a staff, leather shield. Alright. So I got life gems. So are they like in place of Estus flasks? Can I go up these stairs? Does anybody care? I'm, I'm gonna steal from your chest. I, I hope nobody minds. Human effigy. Okay. Okay. So, this way? That's where I came in. I don't want to go that way. Oh, there's, there's another door there. That's a bonfire. Bonfires are places to, yeah. What, also light torches on them. I can light torches? What is, that's a thing. Get out of my way! What are you, what? Are, soul of a lost and dead torch, okay. So it's light, 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 light the bonfire. And rest at it. Travel? Things betwixt. So I, I, I can travel? That's kind of cool. Attune spells? No. Burn? A warm, soft, shadow like effigy. Use this item to reserve hollowing. It also weakens the link to other worlds, preventing invasions and most cooperation. Peer closely at an effigy and one begins to perceive a human form. But whose form it takes depends on the person looking. Okay. Item box. What is this stuff? Oh, is this like my, um... When I bought the game, because I pre-purchased it, I got a bunch of, like, starting weapons. So the black flamestone dagger. I think these are them. I'm not going to use them because I've, I was told that they're very powerful and I don't want to make the game easy for myself. Yeah, these are definitely them. Look at this shit. Yeah, I don't want to make the game easy for myself, you know? Alright. Let's go. I want to fight something now. And probably dot. What is this? Enter the mist. And there's there's more of it over there. I, I don't think I want to... There, there's more of it. What's going on with all this fucking mi I I guess we're going to check it out. I guess we're going to check it out. I guess it's like a fog wall from the original game. Please don't be a boss in here. I'm not ready for that. What is this? Okay, I know how to attack. Evil? I can lock onto it. Oh yeah, it's evil. It's evil. I'm gonna go for a parry. I'm gonna go for a fucking parry. No, I, I fucked it up. Just kill it. Yes! The first kill has been made! Oh yeah. What's Target lock. Yeah, okay, so it's just giving me like button prompts. Hello. Hello. I'm gonna go for a Barry. No, I fucked it up. It would appear I can't do parries very well. At least not right now. I need to practice that shit. So dash, so sprint in other words. You fuck off. Wait, I got... I look like I had multiple ways to go there, but I don't. What's going on here? Oh, another guy. 
Oh, is that a backstab? That was cool. The hell is that? I I don't want no part of that. Okay, where the hell are we going? I don't even. Ooh, look a thing. Dagger. Okay. Oh, this guy's got a bow. You get fucked. Okay, so far, so good. Let's do a heavy attack. Oh, he didn't like it. He didn't like it. So far, so good. Let's just read what this says. That's telling me how to roll. So th these are literally just tutorial prompts. Switch weapon. Yeah, I'll care. Was this one back? Okay, same as the original game. Oh, hello. Oh, we got two guys. I'm gonna lure this dude away, and I'm gonna try to parry him. I want to get a parry. Oh, I did it! Fucking totally parried his ass. I'm the greatest. You, sir, feel my wrath. <laughs> Life gem. All right. So I had a that barely. Okay, okay. It does it slowly. X to use an item. Yeah, figured that out. It's the same controls. It's the same controls as Dark Souls One. The hell is this? Move camp. Yeah, I've already obviously already figured that out. It's a bird's nest. You, you, give us smooth. What? Yes, you, give us silky. Oh, okay. Is this something like in the original game where, where you had um the bird's nest just outside the undead asylum? You could put stuff in it and and like trade it. It's gotta be. It's gotta be. It's gotta be that. Can I? There we go. That thing is not looking good for me. That's probably where the death's gonna come from. Also, it's put me right back here. Okay, so that's where I went in. So I can check out this fog wall as well. Or, sorry. Mist wall. What do we got in here? Alright, two two hander. Yeah. Yeah. Oh son. You just got fucking Ooh! Hey buddy. Oh, I'm parrying like a boss. I am parrying like a boss. Feel the skills. Feel the skills of a champion. Veteran Dark Souls player right here. You know, I have... I, I'm starting to have a horrible feeling that this game's going to be really easy for me. And I'm not trying to sound like all big-headed and anything, or like I'm super good or anything like that. But you're talking, you know, to a person that's played hundreds and hundreds of hours of Dark Souls 1. I don't think I want to go down there. And uh, so far, at least, plunging attack. <laughs> Fucking get owned. Oh, so far, at least, this feels like Dark Souls One, just better done. So my 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 sword's nearly broken. L R T and that doesn't work. Uh, okay. Okay, I don't know. But yeah, well, like I was saying, at so far this feels like Dark Souls One. Better done. It feels like a tighter, 
better made version of Dark Souls 1. Which, if anything, is helping me to play better. At least right now, I mean. Who knows what's going to happen? I can't go down there, can I? Well. There's stuff over there. Okay. This place is kind of confusing. I'm not sure what I'm doing. Oh, there's a door. I'm not sure what I'm doing or where I'm going. Cracked red eye orb. Okay. I know what those are for. I use those to invade other people. How do I how do I get out of here? Oh, I can't. I gotta go this way. So, so, should I just drop down? That doesn't look too high. We got another fog wall here. I should probably check this out before I move on. Because I need to find another weapon. Because this broken fucking sword. Search my surroundings. Oh, ow! You fucking vagina! Did I do something with this tree? Oh shit, yeah. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. No! No! My body! Get killed. There you go. Yeah, it's broken now. I definitely don't go down there. That looks too high. Or is it? I mean, it's hard to tell. I don't want to risk it. I really don't want to risk it. So I'm not going to. I'm going back over the tree. Fuck everything. We'll keep going this way. Oh, messages, messages. What do we got? Hurrah, safe zone. Okay. Now the real... Oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Hurray, hurrah for gorgeous view. I'm not seeing no gorgeous view. It's kind of, uh... It's kind of dark and, and scary. Be wary of ambush. Thanks for that. I'm watching... Be wary of front, and then jog required ahead. Okay. Visions of bad luck. <laughs> Enemy horde ahead, therefore be wary of rear. What? Am I going to get attacked from the front and back? Praise the sun. It, it, it's dark. There, there, there's no sun to praise. Try stabbing in the back. Play dead. Is it possible to play dead? Praise the sun. Praise the sun. Majula. Alright, looks like we've got to an actual place. Like a proper place. Because that, where I was before, was cle clearly uh, tutorial. That I didn't need. Divine blessing? Okay. There's a cave here. Should probably check it out. Hello? Is there anybody in this cave of wonders? Man ahead. Hidden path. Okay. Well. It's got to be this, right? Duo ahead, therefore try luring out. Okay. I can do that. I, I have a feeling I'm going to die. I'm not seeing a duo. I'm not seeing any... Oh. I almost didn't see you at all. Have you business with me? 
The way you under is all blocked up, you see, by this god awful statue. Heavens above. Who thought it a good idea to pit it there? Oof. I'm in quite the pickle now. Okay. Life jam and a homeward bone. Always useful. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, he's gonna break that fucking... Shit. Hey, you can help me. You have a big sword. He's not gonna help me. He's a fucking faggot. Holy shit! Okay. He just kicked my ass. Dude, help me, man. Got a fucking backstab. Barely did any damage though, because my sword is broken. Oh, I got this. I got this. Try to get around the back of him again. No, 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 no. Yes. Yes. Yeah, fuck you, man. We're doing all right. We're doing all right. In our first proper fight. We're doing okay. I don't want to hit that guy on the floor by accident. Get trapped. Oh, he hit me. He hit me in a roll. I poisoned. Ah, oh, shit. I'm gonna die. Oh shit! That poison killed me really quickly! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! <laughs> the first death! The first death has happened! Son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! Let's go, man. We're not gonna go that way. We're gonna see what's the other one. <laughs> like it's gonna be any easier, you know. <laughs> I need a weapon though. Because this broken sword, it's not doing anything for damage. I don't want to use those early access weapons. Because that's just gonna make the game too easy for me. I mean, let's, let's have a look at them. So, I mean, 110 damage. 90 on that, one third. It's gonna make it too easy. It's gonna make it too easy. I'm not gonna do it. Although I did pick up a dagger, didn't I? Where's that? Dagger. So I, I definitely picked that up from an enemy. So I can use that. I can use this, it's fine. Tiny little dagger. <laughs>